So this book is called Dino and the Brave Little Boy. Um, it actually originated from um, a nighttime story that was um, between my nephew and my mom. So um, his grandma and him would talk at night and she would tell him this story. So I made a children's book out of it. And here it is. Mama, tell me a story. The little boy that really likes dinosaurs. He has dinosaur stuffed animals in his room. So his mother begins to tell him a story. Okay, once upon a time there was a very big dinosaur and he had a very big tail. His tail went swoosh, swoosh, swoosh. He had big eyes and big ears and he had big teeth and he had big hands and feet. Everything about Dino was big. So every time Dino went to the playground to play, all the children would run away because they were afraid of Dino. And he didn't have anyone to play with. He was the loneliest dinosaur. He just wanted to have a friend and no one would be his friend. He didn't know what to do. He had to play in the sandbox by himself and go down the slide and swing by himself. He was so sad, he would cry and say, I wish I had a friend. Then one, day, then one day, Dino went to the playground and again, all the children ran away except for one brave little boy. It's right there. I'll play with you, Dino. I'm not afraid. And who was that brave little boy? Me. And what was that brave little boy's name? Roku. So there's a little boy from the bed, the bedroom where his mom is telling them the story. And he thinks he's the boy in the, the boy interacting with the dino. So that's what you can do with your child. You can just insert his name in there. And then he'll feel like he's a part of the, the story. That's right. That was Roku, who was the bravest little boy. And Roku said, I'm not afraid. I'll be your friend. So Roku played with Dino and he was so, so happy. They played all day long together in the swing and in the sand walk and, and then the sandbox with all the trucks and they played on the slide and they had so much fun together. And when all the children were watching, they said, if Roku is brave and if Roku will play with Dino, then we will play with Dino too. So all the little children came back to the playground and then Dino was really happy because he had so many friends, he couldn't even count all of them. From that point on, all the little children and Dino played together and became friends. They were so happy and it was all because of that brave little boy. And what was that brave little boy's name? Roku. And you can just have your child kind of shout his name at the end. So that's the end.